Hello everyone, welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 as Germany. And we're still involved in the Japanese Civil War, uh, well not Civil War, in the Japanese War of Aggression against the Chinese. And uh, this war, let's have a quick look actually, because um, the aggressors are only winning by 27%, which is not that much considering that we've done quite a lot more. Um, but I'm pretty sure we're going to win uh, very soon because I'm actually, I've actually commanded Erwin Rommel and his uh, Panzer Division. Uh, by the way, the SS Vikings are now seasoned as well. I've commanded them to rush forward to Nanjing because this is worth 20 victory points if I'm not mistaken. Um, it doesn't show right now, but it is. It is worth that much. Um, so yeah, that's just going to rush for that. I don't really think there's much opposition. We've crushed um, eight regiments or eight divisions right now, which I think not too many are right there. Yeah, these four, they have hardly any organization, so we should be able to crush them quickly. Also, um, I have obviously rearranged my... Uh, my factories uh, over here in Germany, which is pretty good, um, but we are still lacking quite a lot of equipment. We have, ah, oh, damn it, I didn't want to look at all of you. I didn't, um, well, we still have, as I said, we still lack quite a lot of equipment, but it's actually coming back rather quickly. I'm, I'm, lock I'm happy about this. Now, the medium tanks are still a little bit of a problem. Now, what I did over the break was I actually changed our national focus, so we've uh, finished reasserting our eastern claims. But before we go for Danzig, I decided we're going to demand the Sudetenland first. And um, I've also made Erwin Rommel part of our military staff because he's going to help out our armor divisions, uh, which is obviously what we're focusing on. And, uh, oh, we actually have a uh, civilian factory that's free. Oh, that means we need to build some more uh, military factories. Yeah, let's do that then. Um, I think the south is pretty safe. So let's build up, um, let's keep building up our... Uh, stuff right here. I think that's a pretty good idea. Yeah, build up here. Um, so, I've been doing that, and I've been obviously training our forces, which uh, actually was was doing, well, yeah, we were doing quite well. Um, you can also leave, and uh, I want you to sign right here. Wow, look at this. Look at our Panzer Division. I like that. This one actually, they're all, those are all still Panzer Divisions. They're not the medium tank divisions just yet. Um, I haven't actually figured out what happened to to these guys, but it seems as though we have kind of saved that template. Yeah, I'm guessing. Hmm, that's strange. We now also have the Austrian templates, by the way. Uh, we have not, not deployed a single one of them yet, but we will soon enough. Good, that's good to know. And you guys are still training. I've also... Um, started a new army, the Heeresgruppe Süd, which is most of the Austrian forces, and I've started them, oh, I made them train as well, because they were all green or regulars, um, now, actually, no, they were green and trained, so now they're all regulars, very good. The Munich Conference. Talks have been held in Munich between the leaders of Germany, Britain, France, and Italy to discuss the future of Czechoslovakia. Both the British and French have accepted our claims, yes, to the Sudetenland as legitimate, and their previous offers of support to the Czechs have been rescinded. Recognizing the hopelessness of their situation, the Czechs have surrendered the Sudeten territories to us. The oppressed German inhabitants will at long last be brought into the Vaterland. Nice! Poland gets an event. Interesting. So there's the Munich agreements. Germans demands... German demands for the Sudeten territory in Czechoslovakia, which is a home to a considerable German minority, have intensified. Okay, this is basically just the same thing. For the second time, a Prime Minister has returned from Germany bringing peace with honor. I believe it is peace for our time. Uh, well, if you think so. I don't think so, but that's pretty good. So we've finished our, our focus here, and now we need to see what we go for next. We cannot go for this just yet because we don't have enough troops. Can we demand Danzig? No, we don't have enough troops just yet. So I think it's time for us to befriend Japan. I think it's important. Um, Japan will be, yeah, because then we might actually get some people into the Axis. We need that. Especially, I mean, we're already helping out Japan. We've already picked sides anyways. So we might as well befriend them officially. I think that's just kind of necessary. We do, however, lack some resources. We need some more oil. Uh, United States, it is. There you go. Give us some oil, baby. Um, how's your fascism actually going, by the way? How's it going? Ooh, 32%. That's pretty good. What about Sweden? I'm guessing the same thing. Yeah, 32. Ah, uh, that's fine. Uh, slowly but surely, I guess by the start of the war, they will be fascist. And that's that's all we need. That's all we need. Alright, so the uh, 
they are closing into the border. Oh my god, yeah, we have so many more factories. Uh, so let's have a quick look. We have full infantry equipment, that's good. Support equipment, our tanks are being built as well. Um, our fighters, we do need some more artillery as well as anti-air. So let's have a quick look at this once more. Okay, we're at least making some progress up to uh, support equipment. But we have some stockpiles, so that's fine. Okay, I'm feeling good about this. Yeah, this is definitely helping out. You guys are just chilling there, that's fine. You're training, probably. Uh, we also have 36 submarines. Nice. Keep, uh, keep on growing, keep on building them. I guess we could also go ahead and uh, probably produce a new air wing here. So let's have... Yeah, okay, so finally there's also... Wait, why is there interwar fighters? This is... This does seem strange, actually. Let me, let me quickly check one more thing. There still needs to be one upgrade. Okay, you know what? We're gonna wait. We're gonna wait for this last one to be upgraded. And then, once they're filled, I wanna wait for the next uh, fighter to be built. And I wanna see if we can actually recruit these fighters. Because if not, that'd be really strange. That'd be really strange indeed. Alright, so let's let's check that out. Where um, where are we? Okay, so create a new air wing. Oh, so finally. Okay, so these are truly our old planes. These are truly our old planes. Okay. This is Intel Warfighter. Well, we're gonna use them all. We're gonna use our old planes as well. Yes. Wow, so many more fighters. Uh, how many do we have now? Quite a lot. Alright, you... Uh, we need to go forward for that. We need them to have time. To, yep, you will go to over here. And actually, you know what? We're just going to combine our fighters once again. I'm going to have one big fighter group. 591. Nice. No retreat and missions day at night. Uh, day and night. Good. I think we're definitely going to have a, a superiority a superiority over Poland. I mean, we should. We really should. So yeah, this is pretty good. We have our eastern army kind of protecting our borders against uh, against Poland and then we have uh, Bohemian borders being protected by our former Austrian forces and uh, supplemented by a couple of our own troops as well okay one new guy you're gonna go right to training none of them is ready just yet let's have a quick look at a uh, Japanese theater have we taken Nanking just yet oh we haven't actually oh hold back guys I don't know uh, our motorized infantry is not here okay so we're gonna have to there's actually some resistance Okay, let's defend first. They have the river. I think we might want to sneak around. Yeah. Um, let's actually sneak around. There we go. This guy is much easier to uh, attack. We're going to sneak around here. Hopefully no one's defending here. Because um, then... Yep. Yep. Because then we could break through easily and attack Nanking. And that is um, worth 20 victory points. Which should... I mean, hopefully that's going to be enough. Now, the Japanese have actually landed over here in the south as well. And, um, yeah, we've, we've pushed... They're pushing into the uh, um, People's Republic of China, whereas we are taking care of nationalist... Actually, is this nationalist China or what is this? This is just China. All right, fine. Yeah. All right. Oh, okay. And now there is this... Uh, okay. They have now... Alright, we're just gonna stay here. Hopefully they're not gonna reinforce too much. They definitely, they, they hold the river. That's the problem. They are holding the river. Shanghai. 10 victory points. Could we rush for Shanghai? Man, they, them holding the river is very annoying. I guess we're gonna have to, you know what? Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go here and uh, push in and hopefully we can take over Shanghai first. We need to break through the river somewhere, but they're defending it quite well over here. Um, yeah, so I guess we're gonna have to go around. We have two uh, seasoned troops now. Very good. We are part of this defense here. Very good. Yes, yeah, just break through. Come on. Um, it's, there's actually... We're not deleting this. Let Rommel well, lead it. Come on. Alright, come on. Yeah, he's, he, he's running. They're running. Problem is they're going to be fortifying here. I, I, I know it. I just know they're going to fortify the, the river. Actually, you know what? You know what? We might be able to... Crush this guy. Yeah, crush. We just need to cross river somehow. There's only one unit left. Um, I'm hoping they're not going to re- Ah, uh, they're, they're- Of course they're going to reinforce. Ah, uh, damn it. I don't know. Maybe they, they might be able to push through here? How's it looking? Oh, enemy air superiority. That's not good. Hmm. Well, wait. 
each enemy has the air support? That makes no sense. Somebody, somebody gotta have the uh, air support. All right, all right. This is this is foolish. This is not working out. Um. Okay. Let's let's try and push here. Uh, let's see how this is going. Oh uh, no! Even even worse. Even worse. All right. Let's go back. Let's go back. We we don't want that. Let's go over here. And you know what? We're just gonna try and uh, plan this ahead and push forward there you go plan that because with the planning bonus we might actually be uh be strong enough okay sweden of course we're gonna trade with you oh my god we're trading away all of their stuff but we still need one tungsten um oh shit they cannot deliver more we need a tungsten oh that's not good why can we not trade oh they have nothing Export it has left for export. Who is who gets all this tungsten? Then? Hmm. We cannot trade tungsten with anyone. That's kind of annoying. What do they have? Free trade. So how do I get them then? Hmm. That's bad. Actually, oh, cool. Never mind. We have enough. Okay. That's fine. That's fine then. All right, so what is our national focus at the march? All for, oh yeah, befriending Japan, that's fine. That will give us time to uh, build up some more of our troops in the meantime. Yes, you need to be training as well. Actually, yeah, join the guys to, that, that are training. Okay, you guys, I can get out of here as well. And soon enough, we are actually at the cap of our mobile yeah we can only get one more and I think this should be a medium tank if possible um, let me quickly see when they will be deployed not right now okay okay we're building a lot of them nice um, you are training good you are all trained up nice I like it Good. Things are looking good. I'm actually quite happy how things are Things are looking. We have all of our tactile bombers here. Um, and then we have most of our fighters and close air support over here. Good. Oh, they actually have tanks. We actually don't have... Well, we do have tanks, but I'm holding them back. I'm holding our tanks back, um, interestingly enough. Good. We could actually totally um, modify our infantry here. And actually, you know what? We might want to do that. Actually, we've we've been researching things, so I think we have a better um, infantry equipment. Actually, we do we show outdated stuff? No, but we are researching better e uh, equipment, are we not? I was on the impression we were improved infantry equipment. You know that that's what we are. and support weapons as well. Although this only has an effect. This has just effect. It doesn't actually. I don't think there's actually... You have to change it for that. But we'll see. We'll have to see. Okay, you join the train army as well. Lovely. And let's go back here. And see how things are going. Uh, you still say it's a bad plan. Yeah, I can imagine. But you have... Okay, let's... Let's go prepare a little bit more. And uh, let's go. Push. Push. I hope you... Wait. What are you, what are you guys doing? There we go. Alright, so now we're winning. We have the uh, plan attack bonus. So that should be working out. Mm, now, this is bad. We have no air support here. But we have researched this. Uh, I'm not sure if that's really... Wait. Oh, there we go. We have any research possible. We could just go for Blitzkrieg. That's what we kind of need. Motorization. Tank organization and recovery rate enables breakthrough. That's what we need. We need breakthrough. Okay, let's let's go for that. We need that. Very important that we get that. Researched. Okay, so due to the doctrine, we might actually have an edge. Ah, oh, man, this is close. We need some. We need some. This river is just so bloody tough to hold. I guess attacking it is probably not the best idea. But I don't know where else. I guess I could just. Ah, oh, man, I'm, but I'm never gonna. I'm never gonna actually you know what the Japanese are doing a good job 
they've taken over Hangzhou. Which I don't know how much victory or how many victory points this is. That's pretty good. So maybe... Actually, you know what? Okay, we're gonna stop. We're gonna go over here. And we'll see if we can get over here. If not, then still, we're just gonna take it over quickly. There's only two units. Okay, so yeah, we have to do this. If we want to succeed. From this side, it seems to be easier. Oh, because the Japanese are helping us out. But yeah, there's going to be reinforcements coming. And I don't think we're going to win quick enough. I mean, I hope. Uh, we are using Seas Bridge. Rush Bridge. Okay. Improved infantry. Okay, this is important. This is big because this might actually... This might actually mean... Okay, we've prevented Japan. Good things happen. But uh, we need to quickly check out if this means we have now better equipment. Basic infantry? No, it doesn't. We still have this. Okay, so this just made our infantry stronger, which I guess is fine. But it didn't actually give us any equipment. Okay, let's quickly check out our logistics. Um, okay, we're making... We just need a little bit more support equipment. Good, I guess we will be, we'll be able to get that done. Uh, two things. Okay, new national focus. All right, let's get rid of this. We could go for the Molotov and Ribbentrop pack. Before I go ahead and declare war on Poland, I do want to do that, actually. Okay, let's go for this. This will give the event. Yep. And that means we will uh, split. We'll split Poland. Okay, we can modify a government. Let's see who else we can pick. Uh, close air support, I want that. Uh, army regrouping, division, division recovery rate, airborne assault, paradrop, no, um, less attrition, fleet logistics, airborne assault, I think we're going to go for the close air support, um, although let's see who we can, Hermann Göring, air support, all weather, you know what, we're going to go for this, ground support, yeah, that's going to be useful. Hermann Göring. <sighs> Hopefully he will not we will not have to name him Hermann Meyer. That'd be terrible. Oh, we can actually research some more things. Oh, I totally forgot about that. Um nice. Weapons, we are not quite there just yet. Support battalions, uh, armor. Nope, we're way ahead of that still. Mm hmm 13. We could research some anti-tank. You know what, we're gonna do that. I might not actually want to build them just yet, but I definitely think we need to... Yeah, we need some anti-tank. That's kind of important, actually. Alright. So, Japanese... Uh, luckily, Japanese have opened this second front with quite a lot of divisions, because this is helping out. Actually, let me quickly see... Um, Japan. Do you want to become part of my faction? Base reluctance. Hmm. Okay. I guess we could improve some relations. You know what? Well, I'm going to improve relations here. Yeah. Because I, I, I kind of want them. I, w I want Japan on my side now. I want them in the axis. Yeah. And let's also check out Italy. And see what they say. Ask for military access. We could definitely do that. Mm, it's getting close. If we were at war, they would totally accept that. I think. How much is the opinion factor into here? Italian opinion is plus three. Okay, for every ten, we get a point here, it seems like. Every time relations gives one point. Nice. Alright. Um, oh, also, we should probably check out our train divisions, because a lot of them are probably trained. Yep. Um, give me all of the infantry. Actually, you can hold three more. So give me three infantry. Yes. There, actually, no, that's four. And you will join Eastern Group. Yeah, and that now this is this group is full. Lovely. And I want you to join this over here. Nice. And uh, who else do we have here? You need to be training. You are all fine. Okay. So you, this infantry, I'm going to make you get out of here. You'll be joining our western flank. And who else do we have? This guy. 
Hmm. I want you to join in. All right, so this is this filled up Hasso von Manteuffel. He has all the troops he can command. Good. Um, you know what? I think I'm gonna give you a command now. I want you to prepare this border only. Okay, you have that. And then I want you to push through. This is what I want you to do. I want you to push through, although I hope this does not mean you're attacking how, wh how you're going to do things. Okay, yep, that's pretty good. That's That means you're going to avoid the river. That's exactly what I want. Great. If, if, if this is to be trusted. But it looks like, yeah, that are going to take exactly... I do want them to take, obviously, the cities as well. But this is what I want them to do. Um, so are you going to do that? Yeah, so... Oh, awesome. So while our infantry is pushing through, I guess... Uh, yeah. So you guys, our eastern group, you will be pushing in... I guess here. This is my eastern troop. You're gonna just gonna push forward while our tanks are gonna go around and take Warsaw quickly, and that should be enough. That should be enough to kill the Polish. Uh, we have air superiority already established, so that's fine. Um, and other than that, what are you doing? Why do you not have? Uh, uh, are you going to do it? You have this assigned. Somehow these guys are not interested. Hmm, there's only one, one guy standing here. Maybe if I... Maybe I have to... Make it a little bit longer? Is that gonna help? Hmm. Oh, now they're going. Okay, fine. I don't know what that was, but they're doing things. Good. That's just the way I wanted it. Awesome. So let's go back to Japan um, and see how things are going. We have crushed. We have broken through here. Okay, finally. So I think um, we're just gonna rush. We're just gonna rush for nothing. We're gonna rush here, here, here. I think that's how we're gonna do it. Um, although, no, you know what? We're gonna rush here and here. This is how we're gonna do it. Yeah. And we're gonna encircle Nan Nanjing, and um, that will make them die quicker. And then we can take care of the other things. Okay, computer machine has been researched. Great. I was. Okay. Desymmetric radar. We could go for encryption. Mm, with new methods of communications, new risk. Oh, yeah, we definitely want to go for that. Although this will give us a bonus. Enables radar station level 2. Encryption. We're going to go for both of these things. Okay, so we'll go breaking through here. Lovely. Do it quick, then we can go over here. That the, is that the Japanese? Yeah, we've almost meet up with them. Nice. Come on, break through quickly. I want to cut these guys off. Nice. Yeah, we're winning this. Good. Awesome. I think this war is almost won. Was it, what does it say? Still 30% only. I'm surprised. Let's have a look at the casualties, I guess. 300 men dead. What? Wow, China lost 500. That's actually a lot of men dead. 300,000. I wonder how many men we've lost, but probably not that many. Okay, so they are, I think, cut off. Um, they still have supply local. Okay. But, yeah, that's fine. Um, we're gonna get, we're gonna destroy them. And I think now, we're just gonna run. We're gonna run through this. Uh, let's go like this. Yeah. I don't think there's gonna be much of a resistance here. I do hope, actually, that the Japanese will reinforce this this region right there. Don't know if they are oh, actually yeah, okay, they're coming now. Good, 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 good. Okay, this should be it then. This should be it. Uh, surprisingly, 
the uh, People's Republic of China is still holding on. Uh, that's interesting. Okay, we have enough factories. Nice. What are we lacking the most? What are we lacking the most? Medium tanks still and anti-air. Um, okay. I guess in this case, we're just going to give you some more anti-air for now. Awesome. Anyways, guys, I'm going to have to stop right here. Thank you so much for watching. Next time, we're going to come back. And uh, before we do that, actually, let's have a, one more quick look at the fascists here. Nice. 36%, I'm guessing. Wait. Has war goals against Sweden. Interesting. Hmm. The United States, the same thing. 35% fascists. I like that. I like that a lot. This is really going to be cool. Um, how far is our national focus? Okay, so we're going to get the focus with the Soviet Union, hopefully. That means we're going to be... Here. We're not going to have to fight Poland on our own, although I guess at this point we would be able to. Um, and then we're going to go for the faith of Czech Czechoslovakia. Are you four guys... I want you in the training too, but I'll do that off camera. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me, and I'll see you guys next time.